artsy and today I'm going to be doing a beginner tutorial on the trick called the fan flourish. This is a pretty good trick to learn. Um, I kind of think that it's good to learn with fanning and so our next tutorial probably will be fanning. Um, so tune in for that. I'll show you fast and then I'll show you slow. So here is fast. Okay, so in order to do this trick, you're going to get into standard position, do a basic opening, and get there like this. And so, um, to start the trick, you're going to hold the knife by the safe handle, and I'm going to teach you it slow, even though this is a really fast trick. The whole thing de depends on speed. So, you're going to do two fans, basically. You're going to go one, two, and then do a wrist pass. But the thing is, you're not going to swing it like this, because that's what fanning is. Fanning is swinging your wrist. See how I'm moving my wrist? Um, with this trick, you're going to be using your thumb, and you're going to be twisting it. And twisting it gets you to have the knife horizontally, because that's what you're looking for. You're looking for it to go like this, not like this. Because if it goes like this, you're going too slow. But if it goes like this, you're going at a perfect pace, and it looks really cool when you go like that. So I'll show you it both ways. So that's the trick when it's going too slow, and that's the trick when you're going fast. And you can see a big difference because this went down when it was going fast. You're going to try and focus on twisting this, and that's the whole key to making it go faster. Because the more twisting you do, the more you're going to get a horizontal knife. Um, and I would suggest going really fast trying to do this. Maybe not at first, but once you get into the move, you need to go fast or it's not going to look good. Um, you see how I'm going so fast that you can barely see it? If you go slow, like that, if I always went like that, you see what's happening. Um, I'll teach you it slow though, so you're you're gonna go around once, around twice, and see how I'm pushing with my thumb, and then do a wrist pass. And the wrist pass video is up above, by the way. And so, um, it's kind of hard to teach because it's a such a fast move. So I would suggest looking at the slow motion again. That might help you just as much as this tutorial. Okay, so one more time, you're going to let go of this handle, and you're going to go one, two, wrist pass. So one, two, wrist pass. One, two, wrist pass. And try not to have the blade hit you. Um, I would suggest practicing on like a trainer first, but if you don't have a trainer, then just be careful. So, so just practice with it like this at first, and then get to, yeah. Okay, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment below any questions you have, and I'll make sure to answer them.